Hey beautiful people, my name is Kristen. Thank you for stopping by my channel to try out a new to me clothing box subscription called Short Story. This is a clothing box designed for women under, kind of 5'4 and under. I'm 5'2, so I qualify for that. It's five items. There's a $25 styling fee. Oh, very interesting. This is my first one, so it comes like this. There's looks like there's a little measuring tape on top, which I don't believe they asked me for my measurements before. Um, I know a lot of my measurements, although I should probably do it again, right? Because we're ever changing. So yeah, it says there's a place to enter bust, waist, hips, and inseam. And they give you a little tape measure. So, I mean, that's pretty handy. Return free shipping both ways. Your $25 does get applied to anything. It says stylishly petite. That looks like a beautiful fall bundle. Look at that. There's like navy and kind of cranberry plum and look how fuzzy that guy looks. I hope that's not too hot. Actually, it feels promising. Okay, let's get rid of the crinkle. Let me get rid of the crinkle. Okay. Let's see what we have. Really pretty, kind of a teal blue green. It looks a little more blue on camera than kind of more greenish in person. Oh, who is this by? Monterey. Um, and then there's like a crochet embroidery detail. Very boho. I like that. I mean, this is a nice lightweight, it's long sleeve, but it's lightweight. Perfect color for me <laughs> with my hair and my eyes and my complexion. I mean, that that's a great first piece. Okay. Okay. This is super soft. I love this color, this maroon plum. Wow, that's also a really good color. What is this? This is L... LJ Fem, it looks like. I don't know these brands, but that's cool to discover new brands, right? Is it a V-neck? There's a V-neck, super soft knit. Looks like it's got some gathering kind of puff sleeve. I mean, yeah, and I'm liking the short sleeve. So I did note on there. Um, oh, look, it looks like I got maybe a little jewelry. Oh, that's sweet. There's a little necklace. Let me take it out. Let me take it out, because I will try it. But I'm gonna take it out gently, because I'm gonna put it all back if I don't keep it. I wear jewelry. Let me see if I can get it out and show it off a little better. How's everybody doing? Are we doing good? It's been raining, like it, we've been in drought and now it's been raining for literally, mm, let's see, it started, I mean over 12 hours, 12 hours of nonstop rain. Okay, let me use the back, let me try to find a solid, yeah, there we go. So, very pretty, huh? It's tiny, see, there's my pinky. It's tiny and sweet, but it's just a little bling. And honestly, I could probably use this. Um, I've been getting quite a bit of gold jewelry, but I really like that. I will try it on. Actually, why don't I just take it out of the bag and put it on right now for the whole video? You can do that. Okay, so the clasp is one of those where you pick your length. Mm. All right, what do you think? I think it's cute. Okay, let's see this guy. Hey, this is pretty. I love all the ombre patterns. That is, this is very much my style. Okay, common threads. And it looks like it's not too long. Um, yeah, I really like this. It doesn't, 
it doesn't feel like it's super super it's fuzzy but it's not over hot it's not it's not super thick and huh that's interesting that's an interesting sleeve length it's not like all the way I'm not sure about that and it's a little cropped in length but I re again I really like it with my hair and my coloring all right we'll try it again with the plum top and here's some jeans I've been kind of needing some new jeans but I did just buy a pair from my JB style box oh these look nice cut from the cloth Kelsey ankle flare in a six but they look nice and generous through the hips so I like that no distressing but a little fading and then the raw hem normal back pocket so I mean it looks comfortable looks like a good length and then I still have one more thing that's six things right one two three four five six six things so I don't know if that's standard if you always get six things but I got six things so this is a beautiful green Muse Muse I think I have heard of that brand but it looks like it's a jumpsuit she's cute so it's a cross um, top normal back I'm hoping you can wear a normal bra with it and then I mean the thing with jumpsuits is the length right so this is a petite subscription so I'm hoping I mean this would be really great for work because I can do children's music up and down, stretchy knit, but still be, you know, a little dressy. Sometimes you gotta pin the top to make sure it's, you know, stays there. But then you can put the cardigans. I mean, this cardigan wouldn't be bad. You know, it'd make it very fallish. But I'm, I bet you I've got some other cardigans that would be lovely too. I'm trying to think if that brown and mustard colored one that I just got from JB, if it would look cute with this, but we can see this is going to be fun. I've already got two of the items on. Let's get to Starlin. So I dropped out the note. I forgot the note and it's actually a very personalized note, which I'm also impressed by. So I'm going to go ahead and share it. You can fast forward to the try on if, if you don't want to hear it, but I think that's really, um, you know, a big thumbs up that you would take time because she said, welcome to your first chapter of short story. Thank you for adding the link to the YouTube channel. So she actually looked at it. <laughs> your videos are fun and I got a lot of good ideas from them. Not to mention, I love the Humpty Dumpty egg shirt, which I'm pretty sure that's the one I wore with my husband and I's unboxing. Um, Since you have beautiful blue eyes, I merely thought of the teal colored crochet blouse. Yes, it looks great because it will be a nice compliment to your complexion with a pop of bohemian flair I thought you would enjoy. See, she's already got my style, y'all. What's her name? Elsie. Or Elise? E-L-Y-S-E. -E -E. How do you, how, how? Phonetic, put, mm, there's not audio comments, but I wanna make sure I say her name right because she's doing a great job. I thought you would enjoy. I also included a stylish pair of flare denim because jeans are one of the hardest items to get right for a petite person. I know I'm one. The 24 inch inseam is a perfect length to wear with flats to your favorite pair of mules. And since you had mentioned in one of your videos that you don't need any more date night dresses, I wanted to include the green sleeveless jumpsuit. I like it. It's a good choice. It's a chick alternative that you can wear well into January because of the warm weather in Brookshire. True that. I hope you have fun with your first story of styles. So, and let's see, the whole box minus my $25 styling credit would be $346. So for six things, I think that's actually a pretty good price for a clothing box subscription. So anyway, now let's start playing with the clothes. Okay, this is about as good a lighting as I can get when it's really raining and I have no natural light really coming in, but we're gonna try to do our best. This is the Leela jumpsuit. It is $78. Um, if you just are skipping ahead, the necklace is also theirs. It has the surplus kind of cross top. I do love this waistband here. It does have pockets. 
help me ankle it just a teeny bit so I can step all the way back. Because look at the length. Can you see? Is it too dark? It's like not, I would totally be keeping this no question if it was at the top of my foot. I'm just not sure about the crop because I always feel like crop makes me look shorter. But that's the point of these clothes, right? Is to flatter short, to flatter shortness. So let me know. Let me turn a couple times. Let me show you where it's a little better light with the ring light. I think it's pretty flattering and I love the green color. So it's a possibility. You'll have to let me know what you think. Let's try on the jeans and start trying on the tops. Okay, this top is so great. <laughs> it is just the softest, buttery, stretchy. I love just a little bit of poof on the sleeves. I love the cuff that is on the sleeve that is nice and secure but not tight. I love the v-neck. Love the color. Like how it's got just a little bit of stretch to give a little shape without being clingy. This this top is so good. <laughs> I love it. I also really appreciate these jeans. Um, hopefully we'll be able to get a little idea of them anyway. It's uh, cut from the cloth. It is a Kelsey flare. So hopefully you can see it does come out just a little bit at the bottom with a raw hem. It's got a nice fit. It, it's, it's, they're really, they're really comfortable, really stretchy. Um, feel like it's a great fit around the waist, not going to be, you know, restrictive if I need that. And then I did want to try on the cardigan with this top. I don't think there was any notes on how to put things together. I did read us the note. So there's the different ombre sleeves. You can see the sleeve length. It's just that it feels like, you know, it's definitely going to stay out of your food or whatever you're working on. But it's an interesting choice. It's like a crop sleeve as well as, I like the crop length on here. And it does not have any closures, no buttons or zippers or anything like that. It's meant to be completely open. Which that's lovely. So let me turn. Let's see, does it, at the seams it doesn't line up exactly right, but it's more the patchwork. So there you have that. Oh, I just realized I didn't try on the cardigan with the jumpsuit. When I do the final notes, we'll compare it then. All right, though, let me change. I have one more top. I have that beautiful blue crochet top. So let's give that a go. It's like another winner. This is the Monterey, Monterey, Panama crochet blouse. Let me show some of the detail up close since I don't have great lighting. It's actually a little bit more green than it's coming across. The camera's really picking up the blue, which is matching the blue in my eyes, but it's got this beautiful crochet and embroidery stitch. It's it's nice because it's not overly like detailed or boho-y or anything like that. It's just got nice little touches. I really like it. Again, I like that it kind of feels like it's tapered and kind of fitted, but it's not tight. I really do like the elastic. I like that this one is the right, this is where I like it to hit on my wrist or even a little oversized. Um, just cause I, maybe that's what I'm used to being short, but what do you think? I'm thinking this is a really, really pretty blouse. So we're gonna have, we're gonna have a little recap wrap up and uh, you'll have to let me know what you think. Okay, so what do you think? I mean, I think for a first box, it was fabulous. I think that Elise did an amazing job like checking out my video and getting a sense of what I look like and what my style was because she like nailed it 
there is there's not I'm still wearing the necklace it's so cute um so there is like nothing at all that I do not like about this top it actually goes with several things I already own as well as this comfortable soft plum top um there those two are definitely staying though those two are not even negotiable that I could let the necklace go if I needed to um this green jumpsuit has a lot of use and possibilities in my life I this is the cardigan that I bought from JB Stylebox don't you think that all the fun pattern and color play of this goes really really well with this jumpsuit like it's just a really great fall winter kind of vibe I, I'm, I'm just thinking that could work you know when you get hot you take it off um, let me know what you think about the length I mean with the boots I think it looks really cute but I'm not used to that length um, the pants really comfortable really great can't really go wrong with a really great pair of jeans so I'll just have to think about budgeting wise <laughs> as well as this sweater I love that it's not overly hot but it's nice and soft and fuzzy so soft and fuzzy but not overly hot like this feels very lightweight as far as the yarn or if that makes sense um, and I love the ombre effect it's very kind of that 70s vintage vibe that I like the sleeve length is a little different again for me so I'm thinking I might want to just wear it around the house just a little bit and see you know do I like it or does that actually bother me that's the beauty of having these in-home boxes right you can actually you know keep the tags on don't do heavy lifting or do anything that's going to stain them but wear them around the house for just a little bit move in them a little bit you know think about how is this rubbing me how is this you know handling my lifestyle and how does this go with the other stuff that I already own in my house and so it's just a really really fun thing and I'm so happy to have tried this out and you'll have to leave me a comment what do you think I should keep what do you think I should send back <laughs> what, what 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 should I do <laughs> thank you for taking some time hanging out with me I really appreciate it I I just enjoy your comments your interactions and just appreciate your support of my channel like and subscribe that helps me out helps me continue to bring great content y'all have a beautiful day take care